Well, that was the way it was, you know. I, I, I left school at 10 years old. My father was a trainer. And my mummy says, right, go on, you now, you be a trainer as well. And that's what I did. And we were living in an area called Pallet Town, but it was actually a mixed area. And when you wanted to be a trainer, you went to the professor in the town. And his name was Professor Oak. He was a Protestant man, but he was very, very nice. And I went in there one day, and it was myself and his grandson, Gary. And Gary was very jealous. He wasn't very nice at all. But he says, go on, you two now, you pick a monster. And Gary picked a tortoise, uh, and, and, and when he told it to, it pissed all over you. And I picked a mouse that would give you an electric shock. And that's it. You just went out fighting. The whole economy was based on fighting. You couldn't go anywhere without a fight. So town to town, there'd be rows and rows of people, everybody from bikers to fishermen to old men, female trainers, uh, geologists. And when you lost the fight, you had to pay people money. But I discovered a trick. Whenever I thought my monster was dying, I'd throw myself on the ground. And I'd wake up in hospital and I wouldn't lose any money at all. And that was the way it was. And there was a few unsavoury characters around. There was these two, Jesse and James with their names. And they had a wee smart mouth cat. And they says, come here, you now give us your mouse. And I says, no. And we had a fight and I'd blow them into the sky. And every time they'd say, that's us away now, Team Rocket blasting off again. And I wouldn't see them till the next adventure. I, I knew Brock all right, but uh, I don't speak to him anymore. There was a lot of allegations about him. And they were always saying Pokemon need to understand the power that's inside. But then they cloned one. And they found out he had the capacity for abstract thought. And he tried to kill us all. So that was the end of that. That was it. That was it. And it was 25 years I was doing that. And then, then it was all over. So I walked into the bank and then I, I was a bank manager. One of the best there ever was. Not a cup of tea.